Hey everybody, my name is Katie, and today we're gonna to talk about how to fit your running shoes. Proper fit is the most important determinant of what shoes you should be wearing on your feet, and there's a couple ways we can think about that. Up here by your toes, you wanna to make sure you've got about a thumb's worth of space between the end of your toes and the end of the shoe. So you can scoot your heel back in the shoe and then just press your thumb down right at the top uh, to make sure you have that space. Or what I like to do is to scoot my foot forward until your toes just touch the end of the shoe and then you can just slide your thumb right into the back of the shoe again to make sure you have that amount of space. The other thing to think about is midfoot and heel fit and so you want to make sure here and here in the shoe it's nice and snug but not so tight that you're going to have hot spots on the shoe. If you're getting any tingling or numbness in your toes sometimes that means you've tied the shoes a little tight so you can loosen them up. Uh, it could also mean that maybe you don't have enough volume in your shoe, the shoe's too narrow, or sometimes if the shoe's too short, it can cause the same thing. If you're getting bruising on your toes, that uh, usually means that you don't have that thumb's worth of space between your toes and the end of the shoe. Or if you're getting blisters anywhere, if they're on your toes, usually that just means you don't have quite enough room in the toe box here. If they're on the ball of your foot, it's because it's a little wide in the shoe. Or if you're getting blisters on your heel, sometimes that can mean your heel is actually just sliding around a little bit in the back of the shoe and the rubbing's causing you some problems. You do want to make sure and resize every time you get a new pair of shoes. Feet change size over time, so you just want to start with an accurate measurement from the get-go. And then uh, for a lot of people, one foot is a little bit bigger, a little bit smaller than the other one. So always size both shoes to the size of the larger foot. Uh, other than that, you just want to make sure when you're trying on your shoes, it's the most realistic it's going to be to when you're actually running around. So try them on at the end of the day when your feet are the largest they're going to be. Bring the socks that you actually are going to wear for your activity, so whether they're a little bit thicker or whether they're the little thinner low profile ones. Bring them in and try them on with your shoes. And then lastly, if you use orthotics or custom footbeds, bring those in as well. You can just toss them right in your shoes when you're walking around in the store. Other than that, if you want to learn a little bit more about lacing, check out the links. Uh, and until next time, thanks for watching.